All right, should be live. I gotta say, the music so far in this game sounds pretty cool. It's pretty chill. I like it. around with my settings a little bit every time I take a little break from streaming and by a little break I mean a gigantic break from streaming because I hardly ever get to do scared moderated comment using stories on get get all this nonsense out of here I just want to be able to look at my dashboard stuff you know actions live yeah cool whatever Anyway, hey, welcome VOD people. Um, brand new game, Cobalt Core. It's a uh, roguelike deck builder. This one's kind of cool because it's like you're the captain of a ship. It's like a spaceship one. That's pretty neat. I tried out Cross Blitz, or at least the demo for it, uh, a while back. And uh, tore through all that game really quickly. Or... Rather, once again, the demo for it. Um, really excited for that one to come out. It seems that one seems like more of an RPG and less of like a card game. Uh, but it's still a lot of fun. I've seen almost nothing for this game. I'm going in almost completely blind. So that might be cool. Homies know. All right, let's kick it off. be a chill time. Cobalt, active, terminal. My personality core is corrupted. I've been called worse. Personality core patched. 6.02 seconds. That was quick. <laughs> Your stuff's corrupted. Not anymore. Hello? Yep, that's me. Oh, uh, my head. Sleep early. I assume. <laughs> Eat based life forms. Makes sense. Makes sense. Play cards that wit your opponent. You draw five cards each turn. That's a lot of cards to draw. Each card costs energy. Cards energy costs turn on the top left. Top left of the card, I'm assuming. You get three energy each turn. Use a loser energy. Doesn't last between turns. Got it. I can deck cards. Alright, so you, it's just the one click, huh? You don't have to drag with this game. You can always see what an enemy's planning to do. This one tends to attack you for damage. Block their attack with some shield, sure. So got an injury player rest to this turn out yourself. Ah, I guess shooting multiple times is better. End of turn, sure. Uh, five is a lot. You can use evade to dodge attack. Play this card to gain one evade. Status is a strand of Pass effects, that resource. That you can use to move around. Spend an evade to dodge a shot. Nice. You got the basics down. Remember, you can always hover over cards, characters, or anything else for more info. Good luck out there. Um... I'd rather have scramble than draw, because I'm almost out of cards. See, now I can move to the right and dodge his attack, but I can do it after I shoot him a bunch, right? Let's draw first. 
field search. Block up to one incoming damage. Capped by max shield. Hemp shield. Block up to one incoming damage. It goes away at the start of next turn. Okay, so I don't need to dodge because of the small attack. I should just take it. And then I should shoot him a bunch. Uh, the enemy is going to apply a status effect to itself. The enemy is going to raise their shields. Okay, so I just shoot him a bunch again. This is temp shield. I could build up some more stuff. I feel like I want to do some damage this turn, though. Right, what is this? Power drive. Add one damage to all attacks. It's only got four health left. I can do one, two, three, four. Oh, shit. It moved my cards around on me. That's no good. So now, scramble. Why is he not dead? There we go. That was weird. It like moved my cards around. Warp prep. Gain a shield and an evade on the first turn. Here. Pick a card. Big shield. Capped by max shield. Shoot and evade. This seems good. This game seems pretty movement based so far. Right, the Cobalt Hyperdrive. Yeah, you blew it up. Maybe. I vaguely remember pushing a button and then a white light. Her cards are mostly attack and instant movement. Her cards are mostly flexible movement and card draw. Shielding and shield manipulation. Yeah, you blew it up. Guys, shut up. You have this argument. You have this argument every loop. I've heard it 517 times. Okay, cool. So this is how they explain why. Get there and stop. Oh, there's a time loop. Uh, something interesting. Repair yard. Also for his upgrades. Removal. Something interesting. Well. This seems important. Artifact. Artifact. This is an elite, right? Artifacts and cards. So I would definitely want to go up. Definitely want to go up. Unless this is something special. Mm. I think I take the guaranteed upgrade because I don't know much about the game yet. 400 or something. 517. Well, let's load the end. Can I get you anything? Uh, where is my deck? Show map, show deck. Perfect. Basic block, basic dodge, basic shot, basic shot, block shot, draw shot, basic shot. Multi shot. Upgrades seem more powerful than removal at this point in the game. Three shots. Piercing attack. Ignores all shields and armor. Seems pretty good. Instantly move to the right and attack. Scramble. Move random. Instantly move two spaces in a random direction and evade. And then bank more movement. Draw two, hit for two, draw one, hit for, er, draw three, hit for one. Make basic cost nothing. Making something cost nothing seems really good. Why would I ever choose, wait, what is this? Exhaust, playing will remove this card for the rest of the combat. I kind of don't want to have basic dodge anyway, ever. So putting the exhaust on it, like, Seems fine, because then I don't have to draw it in. Basic shot, basic shot. What is this? Shield capacity. 
Max shield was raised by one for the rest. Ooh, so I could get a, a scaling build if I went with this version of it. I feel like we want to focus on movement. This guy, flexible movement, card draw, attacks, and instant movement. Yeah, we're kind of movement based, so. With that in mind, I'm going to upgrade basic dodge and exhaust, so I stop drawing shitty basic dodge. And that should be good. Is it like Mega Man Battle Network? Find the poison. <laughs> Hello for bothering you, promotion your channel. Hey, I uh, re really appreciate it. No, thank you. Uh, Uncomplicate. Uh, not not interested in a uh, um, promotion at this time. Thank you, though. Also, good to see you, Tony. Wasn't cosmic. What is this next to your badge? You got Super Ultra Combo 2023. And somehow you're a moderator? I made you a mod? When did I do that? I don't remember that. My camera in a good spot. Maybe I should bring the... Camera down. I don't know. Top right seems fine. Eh. This seems fine. Epid. Well, you are the best. You at work, man? I guess I gotta go this way, common enemy. Okay, I start with a block and a movement. I didn't draw my basic evade. This is shoot, then gain the movement. I want to just go on. Wing's gonna apply status effect to itself. I guess I wanna move one right, or move one left, and then just like bank a bunch, right? Let's move one right, scramble, and basic block. We'll end the turn. He'll miss. He moves back into me. Then he gain a status. You might want to hover over to see what it does. Auto dodge. If fired on, will completely move out of the way right. Decrease by one every time it triggers. It goes away at the start of next turn. So he's going to fire on me for four. Goes away at the start of the next turn. Let's just get out of the way again. Um, in the turn. All right, their status fell away. Two damage incoming. I've got enough shield for it, though. Yes, on break. Hell yeah. We gonna hang out tomorrow? We can do this all day. Is there a, a cap to evade? Like, how many times do I, can I just evade this? If I move two to the right and I blast him, I only blast him for one. It feels like it's more worth it for me to move once, stay evasive a little bit. Okay, now he's got auto dodge on again. He's trying to wing me. I need to start de dealing some damage, I guess, huh? Think it, why move when you can be a wall? I don't know. Seems right. Okay, got his auto dodge off. Block shot, got the temporary shot, and then I can basic shot again. I got, he's only gonna deal two. Blocked all that shit. Five damage coming in. He's got auto dodge on again. Auto dodge seems weird. He's gonna dodge right. When I shoot. So I can get him to move with this, and then I move over. Take my shot, end the turn. Get some more evade. I think I'm getting the idea of it now. Multi-shot, block shot. Two damage incoming, basic shot, and turn. Okay, I'm blocking it. He's gonna auto dodge right again. By basic shot, he goes this way. I move left, scramble in the turn. He's got his auto dodge up. 
turn my evasive shot on. Holy shit, he's gone. Okay. I'm not taking any damage on any of these. Stun shot. What is this? Stun. Cancel the intent of the target ship part. Oh, it's an interrupt. That seems really good. Now or never. Evade three. Lose all evade next turn. Exhaust. Seems terrible. I don't like that at all. Move two to the left. Fire for two. And then move to the right. Stun gotta be broken. That's, how, that's what I'm feeling. It doesn't do any damage. What is this? Stun charge. Your next one attacks will stun. Goes away at the start of next turn. Your next one attacks will stun. Stun gotta be broken. It's gotta be good. I'm taking it. I get you anything. I feel like basic shot isn't that bad in this game. In other roguelike deck builders, like the basic cards are really bad. I feel like I gotta take the upgrades though. Piercing attack ignores all shields and armor, so it's always one one mana do two, two damage, or one energy to do two damage. That seems really good. Can I upgrade? No, I cannot. I'm not seeing the card I upgraded before. You can't, like, continually upgrade something. Basics. Um, I think I want to continue focusing on movement. Lunge seems good. But not as good as multi shot. Got head back, bro. Talk. Hey, thanks for stopping in, man. I appreciate it. Maybe we need some more defense. This seems really. This is a huge upgrade. I get three temp shield. Plus shield capacity. Block shot, stun shot. Let's upgrade the stun shot. Red. I thought so. Fight the elite. What on earth is that ship? It has so many guns. Hey, you guys know there's a big bounty out for a ship with your registration number? We did not. Thank you for letting us know. No sweat. Well, better be getting on our way. Mm, no. Okay, it takes double damage from attacks in its cockpit. Okay. It sounds like I'm going that way. Except I'm not because of reasons. I can slide one to the left, but that's not enough. I sure don't want to take this three. So if I lunge two to the right, one, two, then I can move again, but that's still not enough. But I can block most of the damage. In fact, I think I can block all the damage. Basic block. I should have, I, I missed a point of damage there. That was not good. Okay, so. Shield Surge covers me for the turn and I can just fire back. I kind of need to scramble in order to have movement for the upcoming turns. Let's shield surge scramble this turn and end. Three times it shoots me. 
So I can move stun shot, shut this off completely. I like that. Basic dodge. Then I could move twice, shut this off again with a basic shot. Or no, with evasive shot. Evasive shot, and then I can go for the double damage here. And the turn, I'm on top of him. Man, I'm out of uh, movement now. So I guess I'm going for shield surge block shot. This blocks everything, and then I can multi-shot deal the damage. I might just have to slug it out with him. I'm, I'm kind of running out of uh, movement here. Speaking of running out of movement. Go ahead and do the scramble play again. Temp regular shield. And get some evasion. I think I want to draw first. See what we get. We got scramble. Yeah, let's just scramble and move out of the way. See what he does. We can stun, move once, move twice. We'll take one. Be on top of him. Like that. Let's start out with that. One incoming. You can see what we draw, I guess. Okay, shields down. Stun. Block. Hmm. I think we're always stunning. Move evasion. Do him another couple times. Three incoming here, huh? Do we draw first? All right, perfect. Shield surge, block shot. Block all of this. He's only got three HP, so we just gotta count to three here. Got him. No damage. Corrosion beam. What is corrode? Deals the whole damage at the end of every turn. That's huge. Exhaust outgoing. The status will be applied to the enemy wherever they are. Wherever they are. Boost capat. Oh, this is a rare. Deflection. Block up to one incoming damage. Capped by max shield. Imp HP deflection. Okay. Boost capacitors. This seems really good. This is like an extreme good common card but this is how you like win with an evasive build i think you yeah you see mm -hmm. i like that pick an artifact what does this mean all of dizzy's card attacks deal a damage Ooh, cockpit lock on all enemy cockpit start with weak and then heal booster. Every time you heal, heal one more. Well, I haven't taken damage yet. I think this is the one we don't take. All of Dizzy's card attacks deal plus one damage. So block shot. Is that Corrosive Beam? Corrosive Beam is blue stun shot. Most of my cards, I'm taking that one. Give me this shit. This is not a Dizzy card? Brother, all of Dizzy's card attacks deal plus one damage. Is this a Dizzy card attack? It doesn't, it didn't modify it. Did I get scammed? No. Uh, 
Ion Converter. If you end your turn with more than zero energy, gain a shield. Ah. Okay. Name is going to launch an object. Be careful, we don't know what it is. Can we stun that? Yeah, we, we, we always do that. It's just free. Free things are good. Uh, one damage ain't nothing. Let's... Oh. The block shot is getting... Ooh, it is working. It just didn't show up yet. See, on, in the screen here, it's block shot one damage. But in the actual battle HUD, it's plus two damage. Ooh. All right, well, I think that we just hit him with it, you know? All right, launched object. Objects in the mid row are between you and the enemy ship and can block attacks. They're much weaker than a ship and will be destroyed if they're hit with anything at all. Heavy missile is going to deal three, so I either get out of the way of this thing or I shoot it. Man, I think I am. Uh, what is this? One, two, three, four. One, two. Okay, so my max damage output doesn't kill him. Turn. Let's move here and draw. We got the stun. Do I want to move back and stun him? Yes. I think I do. Move back, stun, so no more missile incoming. Shoot him twice, end the turn. I can probably deal, deal four here. One, two, three. I can't deal four here. Move, multi shot him. I should have lunged. I should have lunged. Stay in front of him. I'll take the evasive shot. And I guess now I'll lunge. How did I kill him? Wait a minute, did I just miscount? How did I kill him? Pick a card. Prepare. Draw. Draw two extra cards next turn. Plus two energy next turn. Ooh, that was pretty good. Options, evade, and plus two draw next turn. And quick thinking, just draw three cards right now. I like this. I like... This gives me movement now, though. This just gives me cards and mana. I like getting mana. Thinking... Zero mana draw two? It's pot of greed? Yo. It's worth it just for the content to just get pot of greed though. <laughs> oh no, I, cl I clicked instead of right clicked. What did I take? I took options. No, that's the worst one I think. Oh no. We just got a bunch of cards. I wanted the energy one. I wanted to right click. I'm so bad. Is there a back? Abandon run? I can only abandon run? Okay. Misclick. I wanted to right-click just to see what the upgrades were, but I ended up left-clicking and we took options instead of the broken uh, mana and card draw next turn. <laughs> Alright. I'm really liking this game so far. I like the art style. I like the music. What is this? Shield drone. Beams a shield at its target once per turn. Beams a shield. Okay, we don't have any stun. Take my basic dodge, because it's free. Really crazy happy with... That's what we got options. Draw two next turn. You know, don't mind if I do. Let's get rid of... Ooh, the multi-shot ends up going through. And let's turn on some shield. All right, plus two draw. This is quite a little bit here. All right, what is this? Attack drone shoots a two damage shot once per turn. I gotta get rid of that, so let's uh, lunge, kill it. Uh, stun shot is looking like the play. 
we have one energy left. Let's uh, move back evasive shot. So we've effectively turned off all of his stuff. Let's move corrosion. We just need to stall. You're absolutely correct. Get some movement for next turn because we got to get in front of this thing. They're running away. I really want to play options, so I think I'm going to. Against my better judgment, I'm going to basic shot, options, basic block. Because I can't scramble. Oh, this goes through shields? It deals hull damage. All we need to do is stall. He's totally right. Beams a shield at his target once per turn. So it shields like this way, right? It's two damage shot once per turn. I got my stun. Do I have any movement? There's no movement. Oh, I have lunge. I think I got to go for the stun. Move, stun shot. Turn that off. We can... We just have to stall. We just have to stall. He's 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 just totally right. We just have to stall. Um basic block. Multi-shot. End the turn. Yep. It's it's just over. End the turn. He's he's dead. Damn he's good. Woo, poison build, baby. Well, we got options again. Juke. Instantly move three spaces in a random direction. It's zero mana. Zero mana juke. I hate coin flips though. Converter. X is equal to your shield. X equals shield. Shield equals zero. It converts all of our shield into evade. Hmm. I hate that. I like my shield staying shield. I don't think I want to do that at all. Let's take it. X equals shield. Ooh, wait a minute. This lets you keep your shield. So it, it's either make this cost zero, which I'm kind of a big fan of. Big fan of uh, things costing nothing. Or we spend our whole turn, but we keep our shield. And we get... Evade equal to our shield. I'm really liking Dizzy. I'm really liking this this character. <laughs> this character is uh you slap a you know a photon condenser on him and all of a sudden he's just he's just he's the captain now. He's just piloting. He's just he's just making all the decisions. Uh it's got to be this, right? We're already so evasive as it is. Go back. What are, what are the upgrades for options? Not that good. Then Juke. Maybe we take Juke. Being able to fling ourselves for, for zero. Either of these seem good. I'm taking Juke. He can't stop me. Okay, remove or upgrade. Uh, it's gotta be it's gotta be upgrade. Basic shot costing zero seems good, but uh, we have to do this. Do I want him to die quickly, but it takes my whole turn, or do I want it not to take very much of my turn at all, and they're gonna die slowly? Making things cost less is so powerful, but I feel like this is so unique. Two hull damage at the end of every turn. They just explode. Like post haste, right? It's got to be this angle, though. It's got, it's got to, you got to make it cost less. Riggs, you picked up any hostile ships? No, why? My sense is going crazy over here. You know, no warp core signatures within the light year. Which is a visual spectrum. Ah, big crystal. Okay.
So we could move just one to the left, or no, we'd have to move two to the left. So let's just end up blocking all of this by doing block shot, shield surge, basic shot. Feels good. Is it time to juke? Ooh, she's got it. Yo, hit him with it. Gotta have me my options. Switch over, stun bomb. Okay, I got him. Multi shot. Hell yeah. Uh, hmm, hmm. Three damage incoming. We have three shield. No temp shield in the. In the docket over here i think it's worth it to if we move just one we can stun shot into or like stun shot multi-shot do i just want to stun shot scramble i feel like i i like we just move here we stun shot we we scramble we end the turn we take the one, like whatever. I have five movement. I can just do whatever I feel like now. So if we juke right, we're the best. We juked left. So we're taking an ass load of damage. This is terrible. All right, we got to use one here. So we're not taking an ass load anymore. Got to be options. Block shot. We're blocking all of this. I could move again. I think it's worth it to move one more time. I'll go down by one shield. Let's start with draw shot and see if we get lunge. Lunge is in the pile. Is this deterministic? Right click card previous. Like, am I gonna draw this then this? Duke gets us out of it. Yep. Sort of. Sort of gets us out of it. I mean, I can block the three this turn and still have a shield. The corrosion's ticking up. I could also move twice, stun shot options. That feels bad. Let's just block all of this and deal the damage. If I juke left, good. Oh, there's the lunge. Why don't we evasive shot scramble and just move one more? Shield takes damage, no big deal. We're in the clear. We can just move one to the right now and just blast them. of shot. Basic block, shield surge. And then he's dead. And we've lost literally zero health. Hell yeah. Ooh, we got a little hull upgrade. Don't mind if I do. Chip status. Plus nine, plus nine hull. Oh, you heal after it. Yeah, after a boss, you heal. Cool. Pick a card. Hand cannon. Rare. Parry. 
Attack equal attack damage equals total damage of enemy cannon attacks. Exhaust. What is this? The amount of other cards in your hand. And cannon. Another corrosive beam. Another corrosive beam, though. All right, what does this look like? Hand cannon twice. You just, you just blast him down. Yo, with options. We could go for the big one shot build. The big one shot build sounds pretty good, but it's not at all what we're what we're building around. We're building around like all their ass out. It was a request. Cousin Cosmic came in here and demanded we find poison build. I got it. I got to do it to him. Every tenth time you draw a card, gain an energy. That's really good. Gain an evade every turn. You can no longer have more than three evade. Terrible. Terrible. Absolutely awful. Prototype 22. Permanently gain one max shield on pickup. Gain a shield at the start of every turn. If shield was already full, take two hull damage. Awful. Terrible. If shield was already full, take two hull damage. My shield's not really filling up. Permanently gain plus one max shield on pickup. And shield at start of every turn. So this demands that I start taking some damage on the shield. Every 10th time you draw a card, gain energy. I like this. Let's take this. This seems much better. I've already got uh, a dizzy artifact. Let's take this one. Nice. First time you guys managed to beat that thing. Wait, really? How many times have we tried? You don't want to know. What even was it? These readings are correct. I think it's some kind of time crystal. The microscopic ones in the lab and the cobalt's particle accelerator, but never so large. Did the microscopic ones try to kill you? Uh, not in a way I think it was able to perceive. Keep moving. How many acts are in this game? I thought that those were credits for a second. I thought it was just like, and I was like, wow, I got scammed. Nav system is taking us through this lawless sector. The zone is full of pirates, thieves, and smugglers. Like the last one wasn't. Everyone should have their sidearms on them at all times in case we get boarded. Oh, hell yeah. Do I get a gun? Everyone but you. Three incoming. I got the stun. Uh. I mean. I got the movement to get out of here. I can just move one over. If I juke left. I'm going to get smashed in my cockpit by this thing. What is this? Power drive at one to all attacks? We draw first, right? Get the basic dodge. I mean, I could just move twice, stun shot, evasive shot. Yeah. Yeah. Seems fine. What is this? The enemy is going to raise their shields. Cannot exceed their max shield. Do we start getting the corrosive beam on them? It's got to be. Yeah, I like that. Throw this on him. Get some options. Uh... Oh, this triggered, so I can take Scramble. Is Scramble a lot better than Field Surge here? I think it is. Got the Corrosion. Uh, if I juke left, It's still good. Like, it's still just fine. Second corrosion. I did juke left. I got one mana remaining. One health remaining. I could just stun his ass. Mm. 
but why? When I could just have some options. Dodge. Take the hull damage. We just stall them out. It's so good. Dude, poison build is so good. Riggs is broken with this flywheel, too. I get four energy every turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, it's every other turn, right? And then I can draw to, uh, like, prep it further. This is the part where I gotta start removing cards like crazy, right? If I start removing, like, all the basics, remove all the bad cards... How many, uh, how many cards total are in my deck? 16? If I start removing all the bad cards, I could get it down to, like, a 7-card hand, and I, like, options every turn. Options, juke. Uh, like, get everything down to as low as possible. I'm starting, it's starting to come together. Right, this guy's dead in 4 turns. Shield doesn't matter. Like at all. Let's um start with the draw. We did get lunge. We did get options. Take our options. And let's scramble. Garvade high. All them out. No lunge, but oh, I got juke. Oh, there we go. Prepping rigs. Gaining some more movement. They can't even keep me in the, their sights, dude. Lunge over, evasive shot, draw to reprep, basic block. It's it's just over for them. Multi blast. Yeah. Quick thinking. Hey, quick thinking came back to us. It's yo. It's got to be this. It essentially pays for itself, right? Or do we want to have the... It's got to be quick thinking. Oh, but... But the block shot. This could deal three damage. You blast a... Wait. Wait a second. This is the upgraded multi blast. This is six damage on incoming. What? Uh, upgraded multi blast? Six damage is a lot of damage, but it costs two. What does this mean? Infinite. This card is not discarded when played. Doesn't that mean that we can deal 8 with this thing? On turns that I have 4 mana, don't I just get to just like, lay them out? 8 mana, or it's, it's 4 mana for 8 damage, where this is 6 mana for 2 damage. This is a trap. This is bad. It's just not efficient. The problem, like, I would totally take this. This is this is the best card here, like, in a vacuum. But with our build, we don't have to deal damage. Like, we don't have to worry about shields or temp shields. We don't have to worry about where they are. Like, we just corrosive beam and we run away. So for those reasons alone, block shot doesn't matter. Multi-blast doesn't matter. We just take quick thinking. 
Yeah, it's unfortunate, but that's just how it is. And we're definitely going top row. I feel like we're strong as hell. If we go bottom row, we get to upgrade cards, but this is the two good artifacts and cards this way. Although, maybe card removal is more important than uh, but our, our deck already has some exhausted car cards that, that exhaust. One, two, three. Three cards that exhaust, and it's only a 17 card deck. Maybe it's right to go down. But the, I. I think that if I was only interested in making myself as strong as possible, I would literally just go down here. But it's also really er early in this game, and I want to know. Uh, what the what different artifacts do and stuff. So I'm going this way. Hey, welcome to my Emporium of Wondrous Ideas, Traveler. May I offer you one of my creations? They all seem absolutely useless. Perhaps they are. Uh, Buckshot. Add a card to your deck. One mana, attack for zero three times. Give me Waltz. Move to the left. Move to the right. Crisscross. Lose a hull, heal a hull. Gain three energy for three energy loves. These are terrible. The fact that this costs mana is absurd. This guy's hilarious. This is great. <laughs> Lose the hole, heal a hole. Three energy for three energy. Move left, move right, move right. Obviously, it synergizes with things that we don't have. I'm not taking it on spec, though, is the problem. Like, I could take it on spec. I, I do not want to. We're going to basic dodge. We're going to corrosive beam. And I guess we're going to scramble and we're going to move right, right, right. What is, what is this? Whenever the ship is shot, the part that was hit gains armor for the rest of the turn. And it's a good thing I don't have to worry about that. What is this? Destroying it will damage its destroyer for two. We got the best build against this thing. That is excellent. Um, what is this? I'm gonna raise temporary shields for a turn. Or takes double damage from all attacks. I am not going to kill this thing by shooting it at all. I'm going to take my options. Uh, one, two, three, four. I think I'm... Uh, which way do I want to go? I want to hide behind this mine. Oh, I should have shot first. Nope, I can just build surge. Okay, so he's going to hurt himself, and I can just move one to the left. Another option, I could juke and see where I end up. If I move, like, really far to the left, like, it's whatever. But if I move three to the right, I can then uh, stun shot, right? Because I kind of want to stun this. Another option might be good is lunge stun and then I have move multi and I cut off this and this that is so bad I don't have to do any of that at all I can just move one to the left why don't we just find out what the juke does alright it put me in the worst spot 
stun him. That's fine. It can it can have armor. So I'm either spending my movement and moving left. Or I'm lunging right. Let's spend the movement, it's fine. I want options evasive shot move one to the right basic block end the turn and I get ar or don't I get armor because I had uh yeah 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 uh okay 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 I've got I've only got one yeah So I can quick quick thinking draw shot draw a bunch of cards. And I will draw a stun shot. I also just lunge the hell out of this way here, right? Why don't I draw shot? Stun shot. Lunge. Do I want a quick think? I think I do. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Let's lunge again. Options. Move once. Basic shot. My evasion. I should have evasion shot first. It's going so swimmingly, though. I just don't care. Like, I'm just styling on this guy. And I juke over here, and I'm out of there. Damn, he's good. Just scramble shield search, dude. It's over. It's just over. I'm just dancing on him, dude. I can't handle this. Big shield or stun charge. Zero mana. Your next one attack will stun goes away to start your next turn. Power play. Add one damage to all attacks. Lose a hull. I uh, know. We're going we're going for the, the hitless run, brother. Stun charge. Your next one attack will stun. Stun seems busted. Let's take the stun. Taking it. Rogue Starnival. Asteroid field. You're fighting in an asteroid field. We'll block one attack before getting destroyed. That sounds great. Let's draw first. Got my corrosive and my basic. Do I even dodge? Or do I just stun this man? This part takes double damage from attack. Just smash him, dude. Multi shot him too. Holy moly! Oh, he don't want it. I could lunge, stun charge. Oh man, I don't have another attack. Yeah, let's not then. Let's just options scramble. End the turn. Five incoming. Bro should beat him. Yeah, F it. Just shield surge. Face of shot. Let him destroy the 
The enemy is going to give you a card. This can't be dodged. Get ready. What? What card is he going to give me? This doesn't sound like something that I want. Sounds scary. Well, anyway. Gunshot. Options. Turn up. Basic shot. Abyssal. Vi what is this? Abyssal visions. Exhaust. Playing will remove this card for the rest of combat. Temporary. This card will be removed at the end of combat. Okay, he's just trying to gunk up my hand, huh? Too bad for him. Move over. I've got four mana. Just blast him, right? Yeah, basic block, multi shot, basic shot, basic shot. Dance on him. Abyssal vision. Playing will remove this card for the rest of the combat. Temporary. Hmm. I've got so much movement. Let's just... What's the smartest way to do this? It's got to be stun shot scramble, right? Yeah. I'll use I'll use both of it. It don't matter. It don't matter. Now it's got to be move stun charge. Multi. Draw shot. Block shot. He's he's destroyed. He's he's it's over. Barrage. Shoot, move right, shoot, move right, shoot. For two mana. It's two movement and choose a card in your draw pile, put it in your hand. That's incredible. Choose a card. Choose a draw or discard. I'll card put it in your hand. Choose two cards in draw pile. Put it in your hand. Brother, it's got. It. I'm taking it. It has the word exhaust written on it. Remember that any time that you can keep cards out of your deck, it's incredible. Recalibrate. Draw a card every time you miss a shot. Whoa. Permanently gain plus three max hull and heal three on pick. Now, when you shoot an incoming missile, turn it around instead of destroying it. Draw a card every time. I gotta take this one. This one seems incredible. Another one of these dinky crystals. There's no ship part here. It's empty. Shots fire this part will miss. Cannon. 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 Gross of beast. My basic dodge. That juicy temp shield. Five incoming? I don't like that at all. So it feels like a big trap in this game is going... Like, move right, stun shot, move left twice, like, basic shot. I'm, I'd have to use all of my movement in order to do that. Instead, I think I would prefer to simply move left. Do 
do the stun shot. Take my options. Do, do some quick thinking. Charge this up to six. Move over one more, and then... Oh, you know, I should have evasive shot first. So instead, I'm going to basic block out of shame. Evasive shot would have been better. All right, two incoming damage. Is there a card in my draw pile I want? I could take... Stun shot. I could take options. Lunge wouldn't put me where I want to be. Uh, move left... I feel like I got a draw shot this turn. Draw shot this turn would be good. Quick thinking, multi shot. Do I want option? Eh. I could juke. Juke would put me in a pretty bad spot. Unless. I drew quick thinking. Uh, I got the corrosion on him. Why don't we just build a surge? Block shot. And the turn. It only gets better from here, baby. Where's my stunner? Is it in my hand? I do have stun shot in my hand. Options, move, stun shot, multi shot. End the turn, baby. Damn, he's good. Gotta be stun shot, block shot. I'm always gonna end this turn moving one to the left. I'm full of block, so I should just evasive shot, bramble, move one to the left. I've got the temporary block. He's only got the two HP. It's over. Basic shot, basic, basic shot, baby. I haven't taken any damage yet. Is this game crazy easy? Parry attack damage equals total damage of enemy. Oh, I got the hand cannon. I also got parry. This is hand cannon regular. This is parry A. Attack damage equals total damage of enemy cannons. It doesn't exhaust? Wait, what is this? Return. This card is not discarded at the end of your turn. Oh, that's so much better. That's so much better. Hmm. What are we going to have more of? Cards in our hand? Or incoming damage? Yo, it's got to be... Um, it's got to be hand cannon. And the reason why it's got to be hand cannon is because, one, we're a draw deck with options. And two, um, we can seek the hand cannon at the start of our turn, and this only costs two, or parry costs three. It's got to be hand cannon. That's the better card. All right, it says Dizzy on it. What is this? Every three Dizzy cards played, gain a shield. That's disgusting. That's disgusting. Most of my deck is Dizzy cards, isn't it? How many do I have? One, two, three, four, five, six Dizzy cards. And I want to play them every turn. What is this one? Run ra random any part is made brittle at the start of the fight. The part is not marked as brittle until it is damaged. Uh, I don't care about that. Armor bay on pick up your missile bay against armor. This part takes one less damage from all attacks. Give me this. Okay, free artifact. Okay. 
I didn't I didn't think that was very good, but that's all right. Oh boy. Uh stay the course. Stay the course, brother. Missile, missile. Wait a minute, we want him to missile, right? We've got the uh We've got the thing. We've got the good thing. Holy shit. I'm not taking any damage, and I get to just hand can or like I get to draw a shot, quick thinking hand cannon this man. Is that right? That can't be right. That cannot be right. I just get a seven this man. Ah, that's what the hand cannon is for. Holy moly, Riggs has. He pulled out. He pulls out the gun. He's like, "Yo, <laughs> yo, this game's fire. This game's great." All right, all right, all right. Oh, we've only got the one shot, but it does turn it around. So, I can options dodge both of these missiles and corrosive beam. That seems pretty good. If I juke left, it's really good, right? I could also lunge right and then see about juking. I got basic dodge to pull me out of this if this turns sour, so. This wasn't even a bad play. This was a good play. That's a big missile. That's a heavy missile, huh? And now he's like right in my range. I get to do dumb shit to him like this. I get to go um, sun charge, evasive shot, move to the right, sun shot. End the turn, get my last uh, armor here. He's dead. Wait, where's the uh, hand cannons? Mm. You know what? Give it to me. Come on, pull it out, Riggs. Oh, it cuts it off. It, I don't get to see him, see the fucking, what is this, a possum? Possum pull out the gun. I was not big on rigs until now, but he pulls out the blicky. That's like, what the hand cannon's for. Scoot B. Instantly moves three spaces to the right. So you shoot and scoot. I like that. Button mash. I don't like that at all. What is this? Move left by three. Instantly move through the left. Gain three shield, move left to the three, and gain and evade. Exhaust. This seems strange. Deflection. Oh, this would be... Excuse me, this will be powered up though. Deal three damage for two mana, and then you get shield, temp shield. This is a regular deflection. So we can eventually get, make this a four damage shot? I don't know. Button mash might be good. It's got the word exhaust written on it. I don't think we have any other way of moving left yet, do we? We've got lunge to move right. We don't have any way to move left. This might be a skip, though. I don't think I want any of these in my deck. Get this shit out of here. Skip that shit. This attack hits you, also gives you a status. That shit's not going to hit me. Okay, we got stun shot, basic shot. We don't have any movement. Guess we're going to quick think here. 
It's free because of the flywheel. We got the juke. Did not get the lunge. Oh. If we juke left, it's pretty big. If we juke right, it's pretty... It's one, two, three. It's terrible. I do not want to juke right. At all. I guess we're just banking this turn. Man. What a terrible turn to start off with here. The basic dodge kind of bails us out. Two damage incoming. We got a lot of block here. What is this? this is the one that applies the status? We can get a scramble, we can get a lunge. I do not hate lunge here. What's lunge? Ah, oh, shit, I should have corrosive. Ooh, we got the hand cannon. And we got the draw shot. And we got the corrosive beam. Cannon, baby. What is this? Eco's missile's going to deal two damage it cannot miss. Oh, yeah? Yeah, shit around. Fucking thanks so, bitch. Hell yeah. Uh, that'll put this man. Smart money is on move one to the left. Too bad I'm an idiot. Quick think here into corrosive beam and to move one to the left. Yeah, it feels good. Take it. Yeah. Can lunge. Can hand cannon first, then lunge. And stun charge hand cannon um, lunge. I feel like it's supposed to be hand cannon bl block shot. Uh, or hand cannon stun charge block shot. Hand cannon stun charge. I've only got. I, I don't have enough mana. Hand cannon. Yeah. So it's got to be that. Stun charge and cannon. Punch. And the turn. Get around. Okay. I only need to deal one damage. Ramble. Move. Drop shot. Options. In case I can't count, but I'm pretty sure I can count, he's dead. Another selective memory. Dude, that is so good. Give me that shit. Hell yeah. What are we upgrading? Get you anything? Yeah, we're upgrading. Ah. Quick thinking for draw five for the hand cannon play. Two times the hand cannon, but it uh, costs three. Uh, that can't be right. That cannot possibly be the correct play. It's got to be... Use two cards in your draw pile, put them into your hand. I feel like that's the best. Options... Options lets you draw that turn. That might be good. What does stun charge do? 
Next two shots done. Hmm. Just upgrade corrosive beam again. Upgrade Corrosive Beam again seems so good. It's like the core of our deck. We kind of have to do this, don't we? Do we need more power this time? We already have the cheap one. Make them both cheap. Mana is so hard to get in this game. Hailed by a pirate and a cruiser class warship. Uh, hello? Oh, boy. Sure, uh... Oh, hey, it's you. What? I used to be so soft. This should be easy. Oh, it's alternate timeline. Rate. No, what if he pulls a hand cannon out on us? Okay, he's got... You know, part is concussible. Any shot that hits here will cancel his parts. And this turn. What? Missile bay. These are weak. These are concussible. Okay. We don't have the evasion. Well, don't call it a comeback. We could go one, two, three. And get directly into the line of fire, which I hate. Go one, two, three. And still get blasted by the yeah, it's terrible. We go four actually. We go one, two, three, four. I kind of want the missile bay to happen though, right? Move one to the left. This is the boss, right? Like, uh, hey. Literally every time we do this, we always cross a beam. Now it's a matter of what else we're going to do. And I think we're going to move one to the right. So if we move to the left, but he's got so much shield, it shouldn't matter, right? The shield is messed up. It's a lot of shield. But we could... Pour it down. Six. If we want our hand cannon to be useful at all, this boss fight, we need to start smashing them. Now we're gonna heal some after this fight. This might be the end of the no damage run. Yeah, I just got a bad draw. It sounds like it's the end of the no damage. That's quitter talk. Nah. Nah, I ain't about that. No damage. No damage. Launch something. Launch it then. Nerd. Okay, okay, okay. We got draw shot. We got uh, selected memory, memory. We got options. We got options. Hand cannon is in here. I think we selected memory for the corrosive beam, right? Then we can stun charge. Well, let's stun charge draw shot first. Another selected memory. Uh, okay. Let's not blow our selected memory yet. Although we could selective memory hand cannon, quick thinking. now we want to do that on a turn where we have a shot at the weak point let's options field surge 
end of turn trigger. What is it gonna do? Uh, or to raise temporary shields for a turn. Okay. This is interesting. So if I lunge and I turn it around, how does this work? Does it trigger first? I think we always juke. Okay, we've juked. We have scramble. I want to scramble corrosive beam. And shoot. And I think I want to shoot with Lun. Damn, if I had one more movement... Well, I'm always going to scramble. I'm always going to corrosive beam. So now I can move. Well, I've only got the one mana left. So if I lunge, I'm only taking the one. Let's do it. That's fine. Nah, it's this is a move left stun charge turn for sure. Move left. Let's uh let's do some quick thinking first. Okay, so now we don't need to stun charge hand cannon anymore. But do we want to hand cannon? No, because he has temporary hit points anyway. Stun his ass. Take our options. A basic shot. Gotta be. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We see where the juke leads us. We have a selected memory. Yo, we could selected memory multi shot and start smashing this guy. Put it in your hand is not the same as drawing it. Okay, so we selected memory for draw shot, draw the other two, right? Okay, we juke the right way. Selected memory for draw shot. We got four movement here. Move left, basic shot. What's what else is in? Multi shot? Damn, we don't have um We're gonna have to do some double movement here. Kinda sucks, but it is what it is. Uh, we don't have the scramble. There's nothing in our draw pile. It doesn't reset until you go to do the draw. That's good to know. This looks really bad right here, but I'm only taking three because of the armor. And now I get to like destroy this man. All right, there goes all his armor. I'm blocking most of this. We're chilling, big chilling. Hell yeah. 
see which way we juke. Big juke. Big juke left. We want to move first and then um, shoot. So let's move first, draw shot. Is it is it over? One, two, three, four. He takes another two and then it's over. Hitless run still active? Wait. Do I get the hand cannon finish this man? Wait, what's it? Options. Quick thinking? He's got no he's got no defense, right? So I just move once. Collective memory. Quick thinking. Quick thinking. It's over, Riggs. Do it to him. Hitless run continues. I even said, I was like, that's that's quitter talk. I'm not accepting it. Think, what is this? Discard all cards, draw five, exhaust. What is it? This doesn't exhaust. Discard all cards, draw three. Discard all, draw seven, exhaust. I don't, I don't think we want this. Stun source. Gain one stun charge every turn. Table flip. All cards with flippable actions, such as move, are flippable. In combat, right click or control click this card to flip the direction. What? All cards with flippable actions, such as move, are flippable for the rest of combat. And you move right. Um, this lets me um, lunge left, right? I th we got to look at the upgrades for these. Table flip B. So this is like an install. Don't think I like this. I don't think I like this either. This seems insane, but it costs four. What the hell is this? Costs four. Gain a stun charge every turn. It attacks for four. And it stuns. And it exhausts. This seems like just I win the install blue card. Right? This card's insane. This card might actually get to be played, though, because it only costs three mana. Am I supposed to just take Think Twice? Because it's amazing? And because of the flywheel? I feel like I am, but Stun Source is so good. This seems incorrect. I haven't really been building around this. I already have so much stun in the deck. I've got Stun Shot, I've got Stun Charge. I think Twice seems so good. I'm going to take Stun Source, and the reasoning behind it is I have two copies of the card's selective memory. Anytime that I have four and I'm safe, I can selective memory as long as uh, the Stun Charge is in my draw pile. Like, this is scaling. This like this makes it so that I'm going to be more powerful for the rest of the, the time. If I took Think Twice, I'd be more interested in getting this one than this one because, like, once this is exhausted, it's over. Like, I'm not going to continually get um, this anymore. But, like, this is also just incredibly good. And so is this. I'm, I'm taking Stun Source. Dirty Engines. Gain an extra energy every turn. Add a trash to your draw pile every two turns. 
I want that. At the start of combat, gain a power drive. They also gain power drive. Second turn of combat. Power drive is added, is added as extra damage to all attacks. Ugh. Gain an extra energy every turn. All non parry card attacks deal one less damage. Hell no. You're joking with me, right? All non parry cards? Brother, that's that's every card in my deck. I'm not taking that. Basic shot would deal zero. Hell no. Get an extra energy every turn. Add a trash to your draw pile every two turns. Add a trash to your draw pile every two turns. I hate that. I hate all of these. These are so bad. My artifacts up until now have been excellent. I feel like I have to take an energy one. So I have to take dirty engines? This is going to ruin me. Dirty engines is going to ruin me. No, no, it won't. It's just one trash every two turns. We can play the trash to get rid of it. Let's take the dirty engines. I hate, I hate them. I can pilot ship for a while if you need a break. No, no, no. It really was me. Think I'd look cool in a black jacket like that? <laughs> Riggs is a lady. Maybe, I don't know. I can't tell. Well, she said you're, she used the, 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 the cheat. Yeah. This is where the ship has been taking us. What is that? The same energy signature as the Cobalt Warcraft. Without game shielding. Energy levels that shouldn't be possible. It's pretty. Let's go kill it. <laughs> is that our plan? I don't remember. I mean, he's going to raise temporary shields for me. I'm pretty sure these engines violate like every shipyard code. Oh, because we took dirty engines. Yeah, this is this is messed up. Don't don't look at it too much, brother uh, or lady, whatever. Right, we got sun source. Holy moly! I got five energy. I mean, I'm playing it. They can't stop me. Play it and lunge. Basic dodge. What is this? I mean, it's going to apply a status effect to itself. Uh... Eh. Eh, I juked the right way, baby. I don't even care that I'm missing with my uh, uh, shot here. That's whatever. Got the corrosion on him. Uh, going to apply temporary shields for a turn? I don't think so. I don't have enough. Oh, I do have enough movement. I can move. I can move. I got five energy here. It's 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 okay. It's okay. We basic shot his ass. We uh we move one to the right. We stun charge, multi shot. We play our trash and our scrap. We play our whole hand every turn. Let's go. Play our whole hand every turn, baby. There's a trash in my draw pile. That's whatever. Um, apply a status effect to itself? I'm gonna apply a status effect to you. Give me some options. Am I gonna spend two movement here doing this? If I was gonna spend two movement, I'd just move to the left twice, right? Hmm. 
my draw pile, trash and basic block. I'm not spending my selective memory on clearing trash, right? I did not want to move twice this way, but I guess I'm going to. Seems fine. Okay, temporary shields. They've got a lot of power drive. Um, four on the supply wheel. Draw shot. And cannon them down. Nice shot. Evasive shot. Play the trash. Move over. They get the temporary shields. Oh, they really got my ass here, huh? What if I just juke to the right? Boom! Big juke. What do I want in my draw pile? I could take options. I don't hate that. What if I draw it, though? Feels good. Okay, temporary shields down. Can I kill this man? What if I get my hand cannon? That sounds pretty good. Steal six? Die? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, we, it's coming together. We've got the hand can. Ace? Rare? What is this? Gain an evade return? That sounds really good. What is escalate? Add one damage to all attacks, reduce by one at end of turn. Um. Oh, we could get. Upgrades. I'm saying. Escalate doesn't seem bad, but this is a rare ace. Um, dude, ace seems so good. We get stun every turn. We get uh, movement every turn. These install, install rares seem really good. I'm taking it. You can't stop me. Question mark. Bet you won't let us shuffle all your ship parts. Please don't. It'll be fun. Shuffle your ship parts and gain two ma- ah, Hell no. Are you absolutely out of your mind? No. You really think this current layout is optimal? You see the side eye on that motherfucker? You gotta be kidding me. He, looked, he took a look at my stuff and he was like... Dirty engines, man. I don't know. Salutations. Where's salutations? Can I get you anything? Think about removing a card. Gotta be upgrade ace. But what am I gonna do? Make it cost less? Or just get some free evade? Make it cost less. Gotta, gotta be make it cost less. Hell yeah. Oh, we're growing up, right? Yeah, hell yeah, we're growing up. Oh, we've got the corrosive. This enemy is going to corrode itself. Ooh, this might be really bad for me. Kind of already corroded. Okay, what do I need to do here? Do I need to get a juke? If I go one, two, wait, one, two, three. That would be pretty good, right? What else could I do? I mean, move to the right one stun is like huge gain, right? Do I just go get a stun?
I don't hate go get a stun. Do I just go get a stun? Draw first. I think I think we always need to ace, right? Let's just ace. Then. Under the right, selected memory. And that's stun charge. Stun charge. Draw shot. Where, where did this uh, block come from? What am I getting blocked from? I don't know what I'm getting blocked from. I don't care. Uh, we drew basic dodge. That's huge. And I like evasive shot here. We're going to have so much movement. Hell yeah. It's going to continue corroding itself, huh? Uh, do I want to stun source here? Feels like the answer is yes. And it, it immediately gives me the stun. Take the multi shot. Oh, this is armored. The damageless run continues, baby. All right, this motherfucker has. Uh huh. Quick thinking is free. We juke left. Pretty good. We juked right. We can also lunge. Get rid of the trash. Do I want a corrosive beam? It's going to continue to do this, huh? How much more? This is significantly more damage, though, right? Like, every time I do this, it, it ends the fight, like, way, way faster. Plus, I get to play options instead of just scramble. I think it's armor. It's cheating, but I but this block shot pierces through the armor. Damn, he's good. Erosion, trash, lunge, and I get to save my fade. Um, so this is the turn left moment. Get rid of the trash. If I juke right, I'm going to be so pissed off. Am I, though? One, two, three. Do I just end up moving left anyway? It's not worth the risk when I can just move left twice. Let's, uh... is. It's empty? It is empty. So if we're gonna move, let's just move now. And draw shot. We got the hand cannon. Do I want the options? No, I think I just want to shoot the man. Got plenty of evade. Bang! Oh, I'm out. Okay. No big deal. Uh... Oh, we got the block shot. Big. Oh, he's weak right here. It's over. Damn, he's 
good. Poison build's too good. Whiplash. Another ace? Dude, what? what the fuck? That's incredible. Well, strafe. What the hell is strafe? Fire for one damage immediately after every move you make. What? That's crazy. Fire for one damage immediately after every move you make. What is this? Fire for two damage immediately after every move you make. Yo, I've got to take this. I'm taking, I'm taking strafe. Ace might be better to just like put the corrosion on him and run away. But like the fire every, like, like suddenly we just, we just kill, we're, we're just going to kill them. Hell yeah. I don't know. We could just be more like, we're so defensive. We're so crazy defensive. With the regenerator. I'm taking it. It seems like it's more fun. All enemy cockpit start with weak. That seems pretty good. Every time you discard pile or shuffle back into your draw pile, the enemy loses a hull. Abs at three damage a turn. Every fifth time you attack, you gain an evade. Wait, wait, wait a second. With strafe, does this keep keep doing it every 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 time every fifth time you attack you gain an evade uh this is good for hand cannon i don't know if we're gonna hand cannon like this like i don't know if i want to build like i'm now super reliant on hand cannon uh they, they lose a whole one hole every they, they lose so much hole every turn anyway like hell no every time your discard pile shuffled back into your draw pile if we had cards that just did that if we had cards that were just like shuff, like shuffle it back in or shuffle it back in or shuffle it back in but besides this only caps at three damage a turn anyway i feel like this is the best one oh vertigo ah you all again an extra planar being what do you value most? Oh, what? The? Add a card to your draw pile. Ephemeral repairs. Heal for whole single use. Playing this card completely removes it from your deck. Damage. Ephemeral blast. Seven damage. Playing this card completely removes it from your deck. And innovation. Playing this card completely removes it from your deck. It's gotta be evasion. Then it is yours. Neat. I put lock on. Okay. Well. Yeah. Gotta be the repair yard. Can't get you anything. Alright. Two damage every time we move. One damage every time we move and we're actually going to be able to play it. I'm going for the two damage. Hello there. Would you care to engage in some debate? Talk about the issue. Got nothing but time on my hands. We can do this over and over. Turn an upgrade A card into a B. Gain an annoyance. Playing this card completely removes it from your deck. Uh, this is pretty cool that we can like go back on our choice or whatever, right? I have ace A. No, I'm really happy with all of my uh, decisions up until this point, I think. Is there a card I don't want to draw? Just remove a basic shot. I feel like I need him though to, to like turn missiles around and stuff. Like upgrades seem so much more powerful than um K 
Take big hand cannon, could take big selective memory. Scramble makes me gain three now. Multi shot with piercing. Man. Quick thinking to draw five. Basically pays for itself a lot of the time. Big options. Draw shadow, draw three. It's gotta be stun source, right? God, stun source is so good. Selective memory seems so good to you. I'm taking stun source. It's dealing four damage now. Is this the final boss? Is this our final waypoint? It is. The cobalt is embedded in that singularity. Yo, for real? It's been two hours. If I just like go from download game, stream for the first time in like a month instant no hit the game it's just over i'm i'm i i just won like i might, might as well uninstall what do you mean we can't fight the cobalt while it's inside that singular so we need to bring it out i'm uploading myself to the cobalt now bye hold on there's probably some other way to accomplish this. he's already gone Which has armor and is concussible. That's five damage. And it's weak. Uh... I slide left. There's no way to no-hit it with this hand, with the starting hand here, huh? Man! It's finally over. The no-hit run is finally over. Wait a minute. Got some armor. It might not be over. That's right. Okay. It's still alive. We move over. I'm going to have to give up Ace to get Stun Source. Uh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we are. Yeah, we are for sure. Gun source. Shit. I have to end the turn now if I want to keep my wait. Yeah, if I end the turn now, I give up Corrosive Beam.
How important is it to me to beat the game hitless? Am I willing to gimp myself for the rest of the fight? I'm already giving up Ace. I don't think I can give up Corrosive Beam and still win. Alright, first time taking damage. Ah, it feels so bad. I took damage. I've betrayed myself. But I am going to get this juicy stun off, huh? Uh, quick thinking is free. Basic dodge is free. Um, how does this work with strafe? How does this work with strafe? Fire for two damage immediately after you take. Even one star. Your next one attack will stun. How does this work? I don't know, but I don't think I can afford to strafe. I think I got to... Um, shut this shit off, right? Trying to give me a card wherever I am. That feels terrible. Alternatives, I can stun shot scramble. Move, wait a minute. Let's strafe. It does stun. That used up my stun, didn't it? There's something in my draw pile that gets me out of this. Juke. I could... I could juke. I could juke right. Holy shit. Four damage is a lot of fucking damage. I kind of just like donked him up bad though. I'm gonna take this four. Okay, lunge shuts this off. I have a stun. We have corrosive as well. How does this work? If I move, does that eat my stun charge? Next one attack will stun. I think we just avoid the middle of this turn. I think we just turn left to get the stun. And then see where we are from there. Let's let's find out. Turn left. It it does work that way. It does eat my stun. So it's at this point that I need to. Evasive. 
Definitely not going to fall for the draw last. I'm going to end with some energy so I get the block. Oh, holy mother of... Aren't I just going to do like a billion damage here? Deals three. This is weak, so it'll deal six. Holy moly, I've got a lot of trash that I've got to cut through. That is not good. Um, start with options. That turns it around. I really want to juke left. Of course I juked right. Block shot is the one in my draw pile. If I'm going to move again, I'm going to move to the right three times. Yeah, I don't want a selected memory. So, move right three times doesn't sound like the worst. Yeah, I get to turn the missile around, I block all the incoming damage. bad as it could have been that's for sure okay this hand cannon is not the worst but I feel like I'm supposed to play this trash removed at the end of combat um No, he's dying quick. I can probably mess him up without having to deal with trash too much longer. I should I should sprint for it, right? I'm blocking four, five. There's incoming four. I'll still have armor. And I don't need to play options. But I think I'm going to anyway. And I think I want to stun the card he's trying to give me. So let's do it. Hand cannon. Stun. Move. Got. Options. Block shot. And the turn. All right, can I kill him? 14 health. This is four damage. And this is a move and stun. Right? Kill his ass. Let's go. First try every time, baby. Come on, man. We beat the cobalt. What else are we supposed to do? Hello. Who's hailing us? Identify yourself. 
We have like 30 seconds left, Max. Hello, broken ones. Your poor shattered time strings. I can help. You. There are other souls tingling this time, not. I mean, Isaac and Max, and two others. Now, who shall I repair first? Uh. Dizzy, I guess. I really liked how that was gone. I have questions. I will hear them. This time loop, do you know how to get out? Yeah. Let us out. If you leave right now, you will be destroyed. Timelines are spread over across the boundary. Some kind of pocket universe? Ah, uh, you must be the clever one. Ah, thanks. Hey, wait, there wasn't an answer. Maybe be that way. Uh, hey, my engineer. This card's crate manipulate mid-row objects like drones and missiles. Cool. I'm going to run with Isaac to unlock Drake. I'm going to run with Drake to unlock E minus 217 days. I miss a burst of all kinds of... Getting some deep lore here. I'm trying to write all this down. Don't bother, the physics doesn't matter for a drone operator. Imagine me if I'm going to be a participant in a giant explosion. Fair, there's only one tiny chance of that, so... Oh, good. Very sounds very smart. <laughs> you should write that one down. Don't go inside the particle accelerator. Cool. Dude, this game's sick. It took me a long time because I'm reading every card and thinking out loud. I'm sure that... Uh... But dude, there's different ships and different difficulties. Five whole damage taken. Shameful. Didn't take any damage at all. All run until the... Uh... Final boss here. New kid. Unlock Isaac. Dude, there's five different ships. There's... A bunch of different characters. There's hard, harder, and hardest mode. Get a weak cockpit. You get an extra basic shot. Less pre-upgrade card offering. Minus one max hull. Oh, should I start playing on hardest difficulty? What are the requirements for this? Win or run on harder, harder to unlock this ship. Get 40 different artifacts to unlock this ship. Win or run without dizzy rigs or parry in your crew. The rigs and parry. So I gotta have all new people. Win 10 runs to unlock this. Single central cannon. Do the other ones have more than one cannon? Cannon, cannon. Oh shit. Missile bay, cockpit, wing. Comms? They're comms, dude. They take more damage from attacks. That's what they do. Missile bay, cannon. Cockpit, cannon. Double missile bay. Missile bay, empty, empty. This one's like a catamaran, huh? Unknown artifact. Well, I had a ton of fun. This was this was great. Um, a little past midnight. I got some stuff I got to do tomorrow. I'm probably gonna stream this a little more tomorrow. I might wake up and stream this thing. This game seems like a ton of fun. I love this. The, uh, my one viewer, uh, Cousin Cosmic, came in, told me, stun seems broken, make a poison build. And uh, that's exactly what we did. Seems like there's a lot of um, versatility in the builds. So you get to feel it out. This game's, this game's great. I love this game. Events are harder to start combat with real. 50% hole missing. Minus three max hole. Damn. They really tear you up. I might have to play on hardest, though. This is the problem. What is corrupted court? 
That sounds like a bad card plus a basic shot. I didn't feel like basic shot was terrible, but maybe it is. Maybe it's just because I was playing on normal. Events are harder. Start combat with a weak cockpit. We'll try hard. Try hard next time. But anyway, I'm, I'm logging off. Uh, for everybody watching the VOD, thanks so much. Um, I think I'm going to stream this a little bit tomorrow, too. This game seems like a lot of fun. I'll take it easy.